Hey, my name is Annie Nagel. Um, today we are going to be clamming. Uh, we got a low tide. We are on our way to the clamming spot. And we dropped a couple of crab pots to try and get some crabs, but hasn't been a good uh, bite, I guess, lately. So we are off to uh, this little island that you can only get to by boat or kayak. Here we are. If you look down, there will be little holes everywhere and sometimes they'll squirt indicating that there's a clam down there. So you start digging and feel around for a clam. The bigger ones tend to be deeper and harder to get. Here Nick holds the walls of this hole so it doesn't collapse on me. That's a big Washington clam and then these are horse necks. First you'll want to put the clams in a bath of iced fresh water and then you'll clean them and take the shells off and remove the guts. Since we were making this for a pretty big group of people, we doubled the recipe. Start with butter, add the veggies and the thyme. You want to season it as you go. <laughs> Once the veggies are soft, you'll add some broth and clam juice. Ooh, and while that cooks, we will blanch the siphons um, so we can take the outer skin off. And we dice up the siphons and the body meat. Thicken the chowder by making a roux and adding one to two cups of broth and then putting it back in. We added hedgehogs, but mushrooms are optional. Now add the cream and some more salt and pepper. Cook low and slow. Look at how much thicker that is. When it has thickened to your liking, you can add your clams. First bowl coming up. Grab some bread. Thank you. Hope you enjoyed this video as much as we enjoyed our chowder. 